So you can see I've blended in one side of my nose and I'm gonna blend in the other side. And again, if your fingers are just feeling a little too big, just get a tool and blend it together. And you wanna blend your nose, the side of your nose into the tip uh, so it looks like everything's connected. Like that. And then I'm just taking a minute to sort of flatten out the bottom part of my nose uh, so that when I make the nose holes, I don't have too rounded of edges sort of on the bottom. And I'm gonna blend in on the bottom. Now, to make the nose holes, because we want it to look real. We want a person to look like they could, they could smell the spring flowers if they wanted. So uh, we're gonna take a tool. I'm gonna take this wooden tool and I'm gonna start pressing uh, into this person's nose. And I don't wanna press straight up. I just wanna press sort of in and sort of towards the inside of their head. Because if I press straight up, it's gonna go right through the nostril. That would not look right. So here I have my nose. I'm gonna push a little bit this way, a little bit this way, smooth it out. Ah, so now they could smell the flowers or at least breathe there. And then you can also use your tool if you have to sort of reshape. I have a little bit of issue where I blended. So I'm gonna kind of reshape my nose a little bit there and make some indentations around the side. So most people's nostrils are really defined And that's the nose.